Yo, and welcome back to Electrical Hacks. Here we are at a main panel. We're just gonna temporarily feed it back to it with this big cord here out there. There. Oh, this is nice, huh? Up to the power pole. So we can uh, back feed this main panel and power up the house basically with this little tiny <laughs> number six wire. <laughs> but we're not gonna take it all on, so it's okay. Look at this. I mean, that is a lot of flex MC cable and wire. But it's all labeled, dialed in, looking good. <laughs> a lot of stuff here. And a whole lighting control system. So, anyways, I'm gonna power that up, get the lights going, and the plugs working in this house. Right, so now we have it all hooked up down there. We're gonna take this ooh, sketchy trail over to that temporary power cord and hook it up right there. And let's make our way over the nail, across the woods, and we're gonna tie it in. So, here's the cord. Kind of ran down there and i'll show you the continuation there but now we're going to tie it up nice and neat here with the zip ties and get it tied in there and the cord is strewn across here and i double wrapped it so they can't pull tight i'm going to zip tie it go up and pull tie it in i like to do it right you know take a little bit of pride in your work makes it more fun and you have the music going but i can't do it while i'm recording so i sacrifice my music for this okay <laughs> electrical hacks episode four temporary power all right there's a the breaker we got our black and our red gonna get into there Let's see if we can one hand it so oh. all right all right now this is the important part listen carefully before you turn on the power here this pole Make sure all your connections are on down there, but the main panel is switched off. Because you can turn it on here. Ton put this cover on. And then go down to the main panel. And uh, and uh, after now that we got the main panel turned on, we're gonna go turn that on in a second. But you can see we have all these remote lighting modules for the lights that they do um, here. So all this is gonna be wire nutted off and safe before we turn anything on. So, so this is the electrical hack how to temp up a house so you can have power before you actually get a meter. Now this panel here in the garage is considered the main panel, but the meter is detached from the house up at the top of the driveway. But that's just a meter. Uh, we're feeding a two inch conduit up there for landscape lighting and uh, some ACs and stuff like that. Uh, one in the garage. You see all these little wood frame walls. Those are just, like I said, they added them on. It's all like, look at the ceiling. Really cool house. But we are going to the main panel. It's right there. That's where that was. <laughs> Yo, that's right that. so in here. The main breaker was off. Yeah, so, all right, there's our main panel. Oh, no, we're good. We're tied in, we're live, we're temped up. So now, you yeah, yeah, now if I could, yeah, now if I could ever hear if this guy shuts up. I can, <laughs> I can uh, turn some of these breakers on and get some of the lights going. But we got to get the covers and find out all the labeling and all that first. But we got to, we got all, see if we have all the number codes here. I got to go grab all the number codes and only turn on the ones that we need. But anyways, that's it for electrical this, hacks number four. That's what he's got. John Doe uh, chiseling the floor hack. I got electrical hack number four, how to temp up a house. Any anyway. questions for electrical, post them in the comments and I got all your questions answered, maybe, hopefully. I'm a residential, commercial, journeyman electrician, and AV systems. Keyword hack. Kaboom, yeah, electrical hacks, meaning like, maybe I'm a hack or maybe I'll show you a hack to make it get it done easier. I'm a ghost. <laughs>